We're now going to look at reading bar charts. So here we've got a bar chart and it shows the um, shoe size of uh, boys and girls in a particular year group, so year six students, and it's got frequency up the side and it's got the shoe size down the bottom. So the first question says, and it's a dual bar chart, okay, because it's got boys and girls. So you've got one bar for boys and one bar for girls. So the darker ones are the boys, so we call the black ones though for boys and the grey bars are for girls. So the first one, you'll see there's a small number of boys with size 4 and more girls with size 4 and so on and so on. Okay, the first question then says, how many girls have shoe size 4? Okay, so the first thing to consider is girls are the grey bar and it says shoe size 4. So that's this bar here. So girls, the grey bar with shoe size 4, it goes 10 and let's just see. It's important to check what each one of these lines are worth, okay? So it's gone from 10 up to 15, and there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 lines. So each one of them is 1, so that's 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So this one is going across to 12, so there's 12 girls with shoe size 4. So this one, how many girls are there with shoe size 4? The answer would be 12. Okay, the next question. Which shoe size is the mode for the boys? Now watch the video for the mode if you don't know what that is, okay? The mode is the most common, okay? So what shoe size is the most common for the boys? So the boys is the black bar, so you're looking for the highest black bar. You can see here the highest black bar is at five and a half. So the most common shoe size for the boys is five and a half. That means the mode for the boys is five and a half. How many girls have a shoe size greater than six? Now, greater than six means that it's going to be, it's not six, it means it's six and a half or seven. And it's how many girls, so it's the grey bar. So greater than six, so it can't be that. So six and a half, there's no girls who've got a six and a half. And seven, you can see that there are, there's one student with a shoe size of seven. So that means that how many girls have got a shoe size greater than six? The answer is one, this one girl down here. Last question. It says, how many more girls than boys have a shoe size of four and a half? So we're looking at this four and a half. As you can see, the gray bar is for girls and it's taller than the black bar for boys. So there's more girls for, than boys with that shoe size. And also now, how many more? So this bar goes up to 20. So there's 20 girls with a shoe size of four and a half. The boys bar goes up to eight. So 20 subtract eight equals 12. So there are 12 more. There's 12 more girls and boys that have a shoe size of four and a half. I'll show you your method. 20 subtract 8 equals 12. Just show how you've got that answer.